Stocks shot higher right after the opening bell on more proof the job market is recovering. The government says employers added a better than expected 203,000 jobs in November, while the unemployment rate fell to a five-year low of 7 percent from 7.3 percent. There was also strong growth in high-paying sectors like manufacturing and construction. But economists say it is yet to be seen if the stronger than expected jobs report is enough to convince the Federal Reserve to pull back its stimulus program. Fed policymakers meet again December 17th. Americans spent more than they earned in October. The government says consumer spending rose three-tenths of a percent, even though wages and salaries barely budged. And you're apparently never too young to be tech savvy. Just in time for the holidays, Fisher Price is out with a bouncy chair for children that lets them watch videos and play with different apps on the iPad. But some parents and child development experts are slamming the device. In fact, the American Academy of Pediatrics recommends no screen time at all for children under the age of two. And finally, Wall Street remembered Nelson Mandela today. Traders observed a moment of silence before the opening bell to honor South Africa's former president. And that's your Money Watch. For the latest business news, follow me on Twitter at AlexisCBS News. At the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Alexis Christophorus.